Over the course of the last seven years, I've probably done close to 2,500 aerial restorations. I would say a lot of them are post-cancer recovery, unfortunately, and that is the majority of my clientele. Areola restoration is the 3D tattooing of areola and nipples. Areola restoration and 3D nipple tattooing actually allow me to tattoo people who are post-mastectomy or have had top surgeries. If you could tell me about why you're here today, what your goals are, and then um, I can help kind of steer our consultation, answer all your questions, and tell you what we're gonna get into before I have to change to a robe and everything. So uh, two years ago, um, almost exactly two years ago, I was diagnosed with stage four breast cancer at 25 years old. So, so <laughs> that was like a big shock to my life, obviously. Right now I'm NED, which is no evidence of disease. Yay. I've got my double mastectomy done. Just last December, I went through my reconstruction. This is my last procedure I should have to do. Just having that affirmation and looking at myself in the mirror and not feeling like, whoa, what happened to my body? Because it's really weird coming back from surgery and you have all these scars and everything looks different. So any little thing you can do to feel more at home is absolutely worth it. I'm really excited to feel more normal and just more like affirmed in my own gender even. In the appointment, when they're in, we draw shape, we talk about color. I have clients that want hearts. I have clients that want husband's initials. I'm happy to mimic um, any color, shape, or size that they'd like. And yeah, I've seen say. some of your work, so I saw the hearts and I was like, oh my Ooh. goodness. <laughs> and you still want a nipple inside and have it yeah. like 3D, just like as if it was a heart area. Yeah, nipple, totally. I decided to do the heart shape. I consider myself to be very like outwardly extra. I love to like, show up and look a little different. I don't want to look like everybody else. Now I have the chance to do something a little different, so why not? I'm really excited. I'm like a little bit nervous, but I've gotten a lot of tattoos before, so I'm used to that part of it, but just so excited. I've been waiting for this since I got my first surgery, which was like a year and a half ago. Okay. Yeah. By the time clients get to me at the end, they have this emotional journey they've just completed. In the mastectomy, I'm seeing the end of a really rough road and it's always really happy and it's always really joyful and I think it, there's something so beautiful in that. It means so much. Um, just feeling normal and being able to enjoy any of the time I have on earth is like so powerful to me now. I just want to like live and love and feel good and part of feeling good is feeling comfortable in your own body. Having that feminine energy kind of stolen from me and then being able to reclaim that now is so empowering and just finding myself all over again.